Hi, I'm Mike Thompson. Lately, I've been making a few things for Christmas, specifically some ornaments. I've made two different styles lately. I did this segmented turning one on the lathe, and I did a couple 3D printed ones that I intend to give away as gifts. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I made the 3D printed version. I started by creating a vertical axis and then a set of planes 30 degrees apart. I then created a revolved surface two and a half inches in diameter. The planes were then used to create intersection curves on the sphere. I must say that it took me a while and several attempts before I settled on the design strategy that I'm showing you now. I then placed a point upon each plane and connected it to the origin with a construction line. These points were dimensioned 45 degrees from the vertical axis, resulting in three evenly spaced points from the north and south poles, and each 30 degrees apart around the axis. I then use a curve through the XYZ points to create this nice S-shaped figure. I also sketched a circle on a plane normal to the end of the curve and swept it. I then repeated this on the opposite side. Then these two S's were patterned around the axis 12 times. Then I flattened the bottom so it could sit flat if needed, and cut a hole through the top and bottom along the axis to allow a wire or string to pass through. Then I cut it in half at the top plane so I'd have two bodies, but you don't really need to do this if you just shift half your file beneath the print bed. I sliced it in 250 micron layers and used only two shells at 20% fill. I did put a 5mm raft on this to keep the little legs stuck to the bed until they're joined, and there is support at the very center. Half an ornament consistently takes an hour and 17 minutes and uses 9 grams of filament. I thought a floating initial in the middle would be nice, so I printed several and ran a wire through the letter before running the wire through the ornament and epoxying it all together. It can even spin. Well, you can see it's really not all that difficult. It's a lot of fun, and whoever you give these to will really enjoy them. Go ahead and download the files from my website, mikesinventions.com, so you can get a jump on next season's gifts. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm Mike Thompson, and thanks for watching. I really appreciate it.